Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be drawing Reaper from the Call of Duty game. So let's start. First, we are going to switch on Symmetry Y and go to Draw Styles. Now we are going to draw a line straight, just like that. Okay, um, and we are going to draw it down. Okay, so the symmetry is on, so we can only draw on one side and it will automatically replicate it. So we are going to draw two lines like that, connect them and make a line going outward a bit. Now go down. It has to face a bit outwards. And now if you reach this step, good job. Wait, no. I don't think it came up proper. It has to be a bit bigger, I think. Yeah, okay. Because the face looks just, just a bit too narrow. Follow the same steps. Just make it a bit wide like how I'm doing. Okay, there. Now go down. And make another line adjacent to that. Now we're gonna make a box. Out out connect them okay that didn't come out proper we're gonna go out and connect that seems good now we go down this way you know we go up and connect those two okay now we're gonna go down with two lines which is right next to each other now I think predictive stroke will come in handy here because we can make a curve so we make one curve like this and one curve like this and we will connect them just like this that's good now go to back to draw styles make a line here make a line down and connect those two lines together and now we'll make four corner lines one two three and four now we're gonna join those four connectors one two three and four now if you reach this well done if you've not, then you can always slow down the video, you can do it and then you can follow along. Now let's start off with this, we're gonna make a line and we're gonna connect it and we're gonna do it again inside, so that's gonna be the one eye in the middle of the face. Now we're gonna make slanted line and connect it, now we're gonna make it up, now we're going to form this kind of shape, so slanted, down and another down line and connect. Hold up one second, that didn't come out proper. Okay, so same steps. Just slanted line, straight, connect it up like this. Now we want to make a slanted line. Now we want to make two lines going down, one and two. Now we will connect them. And now from the eye, we'll connect it down to this area like this. There. That's perfect. Now we're going to make another slanted line below the mouth area. So one slanted line, connect it straight. And now we're going to make a box below. So down and connect. So that is the front inside part of the face. Now I think we can move on to the top part such as the head and the ears part and stuff. So first what we're going to do is we're going to make two lines like that and connect them. Okay, so once we've connected them, um, we're gonna make outwards two lines, one like that, and we're gonna go down now, and we're gonna connect it to the face. Now connect those. Now we're gonna do it again, upwards. We're going to go outwards and connect back to the face, connect the line. And we're gonna do this for the third time, it's gonna be a bit different. Upwards make a slight edge and then we're going to connect it Once you're done with that as always go outwards and connect down to the face So now that we're done with that. We're going to do the outside ear part. So we'll go out down oh Wait that didn't come proper. Yeah, I'll just add a dot and out okay, wait One second So it has to be a bit slanted not too much Okay, and then a line right next to that. Now, we're gonna connect it. Okay, there. That's just like a gray line, it's supposed to be. We'll go out, down, in. Now we'll go like this, back in. We'll go up, and we'll go slanted. Now that's the ear area. We're going to make these air vent kind of things later. So we'll make a slanted line like this, like a ledge. Um, that's just like a folding area. 
Now we'll make a vent kind of thing. So down, slanted, we'll make a tiny little edge and we're going to connect those edges together. Now we'll make a line connecting right next to that. If I'm going too fast again, you can always slow down the video. Now we'll connect that to the face. So that's the reaper. Um, this is the basic drawing. Now we're going to color it in obviously. So we'll go to solid fill. Okay, so the solid fill is basically the option right next to the move. And uh, I've, I've got my uh, palette out right here. So I'm just going to color these in like that. You can follow the same way I'm coloring. Okay, so we're gonna want to color a light yellow. Oops. So light yellow on the outer parts. Now on the boxes as well. And then in the gaps between the box and the slanted part. And the mouth area. The mouth area can be a bit dark actually. Like that. Hmm. That seems really good. Okay, so that seems fine. We can go get a really dark grey. We can color these areas in. Like this. Now the middle area. And the lines. Okay, and I think we can use a lighter grey for this. Lighter grey. Like that. And the middle box as well. So that's fine. Now we're going to move on to the eyes. It's going to be red color. Oops, sorry. Okay, so those side bars also are red. They're glowing. Now we'll take a pinkish color and fill that in. Um, since we want a gradient. Now we're going to take symmetry. Okay, I'm going to zoom in a bit. Okay. Okay, yeah, it's not exactly symmetric. Uh, I got to move the line a bit. Okay, so I'm going to move it to the middle. And now, okay, wait. I'll just make a line like this that seems good and now in the bar area here one white and then white lines down here now we're going to make this design on the top so it's going to require seven lines so that's two four six switch off symmetry and then just make a straight line in the middle of that so that's seven lines um and yeah i think that's enough details i mean we can add it over here as well a bit more detail if you want Okay, so that's the Reaper character. I'm just gonna get black. I'm going to sign my drawing now. As always, I'm gonna do my signature. And I'm going to add the year 2021. Always like to know when I drew my characters. And yeah, that's how you draw Reaper, guys. And if you enjoyed, then uh, make sure you like this video. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And tell your friends to subscribe to me. Um, cause I'm going to be uploading, uh, uh, more often nowadays and also, uh, stay tuned. I'm going to keep, uh, making, uh, more, uh, Call of Duty drawing videos, uh, of more characters such as Captain Price and Soap and many more. So yeah, that's all for today. See you guys later.